Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Eeyore and this is Civilization V as the Evil Spirits, Mima. Alright, so I was trying to think of how I was going to do things. I tried. I went and tried to look up a few things, like trying to figure out what the war magic stuff is, but I couldn't find any information, so I'm assuming it's nothing. I'm assuming the only thing I can really use my faith for is to make skeletons. Um, the problem is, is we need faith. Um, and the only way we can really significantly increase our faith is with tile improvements. So that's probably what we're going to do. But first we're going to go ahead and take care of these locations. And then I'm just going to start putting crypts everywhere. Alright, so with that taken care of, let's go. All right, got a free unit, awesome. Now the question is, is, is there any place I need to go? No. I can do a little bit of spawn busting. That can always be useful. But, nah, that's fine. I'm just gonna stick with what we have. I really appreciate the, the music changes. We're top in literacy. That's it. No big surprise there. So yeah, we'll finish the cattle, get the spices, and then move from there. Alright, just about done here. This week is in the classical era. Wait, classical era? Are you serious? Oh, okay, that's fine. I'm thinking I'm in the Renaissance era for some reason. Alright, pasture's done. Get the spices. And then we're gonna start sp we'll start putting up crypts. I'll probably keep um I'll put farms uh, around the river and I'll put crypts everywhere else. But first I need to get this happiness going. So this is going to give me production and gold. Atsua has declared war on Kabul, which is over here. Yeah, having two warmongers, it's going to be pretty interesting. And Moria is probably, I don't know if how they play, I don't know how the AI plays, but they, if if they want to take full advantage of their ability, they probably want to do religion and just immediately go on a crusade. Mathematics is the gate and key to All right, we'll finally finish the National College, which will give us a nice t uh, tech boost. Okay. Stonehenge would be nice. Honestly, it would be pretty good. Chances are we're not going to get it, though. Um, I almost rather just get the water mill up and running, get and go from there. Yeah, as I would love to get it, but it's just not viable at the moment. Um, so we're actually going to probably switch off from uh, Wonders for the time being. Get that up and running. Statue of Zeus. I mean, I, I'm expecting Moria sh to Moria Shrine to be making freaking Stonehenge by, by now. Anyway, we do get free culture building, so we get a uh, free monument, which is nice. So 
but this is the only spot that has planes around me. Eh, oh well, it happens. It's gonna take another four turns. We're not making very much money, unfortunately. Uh, Suica has declared war on Conoco. It's begun. So that's a thing. Has anyone got a religion yet? Nope. Got that up and running. How are we looking tile-wise? Yeah, we got a bunch of tiles that are not being used. Um, how are we looking? After metal casting, let's go straight for civil service. So in the meantime, let's go ahead and get farms up and running near the river. I'm kind of on my way to getting um, my Pantheon. It's going to be a while, though. I'm not too concerned about getting religion, even though it would help. Uh, I just need faith income so I can use the sorceress. Because those skeletons that she makes get stronger as with each era. So, uh, Sixth place. Kanako versus <laughs> 78 versus 261. Good luck, Kanako. Yeah, she's getting wrecked. Have fun with that. So we're going to build farms there. Also, we'll get more money uh, from crypts as well. The only thing about crypts is you can't put them adjacent to each other, which is completely fine by me. But I'm going to put farm here, farm there, and, then farm, and finish this farm here that has one turn left, and then start spamming crypts. Um, if this gets done, well, I might go straight into Stonehenge. Because, I mean, if they're not going to take it, I'll take it. I mean, it's more likely going to fail by the time I start working on it. But it'll get me some gold, I guess. So it's not the end of the world. Uh, happiness has increased greatly. That's good. Oh good, we're allies with these people all of a sudden. That's good. That's probably why we're ha our happiness increased. We're just going to drop very soon. Pyramids have been made. Yeah. She's about to lose her city. Her best chance though is um, she may be able to hold them off. Uh, hold off Suica here, because there's freaking, it's just a choke point. And I'm pretty sure she doesn't have sailing yet. She usually doesn't get it until, unless she has a, unless she's on a coast already. Yep. I should get a free unit, at least, uh, eventually. That's good. Alright, we can find, uh, find a Pantheon. Um, what can I get benefits from? Happiness from cities on rivers, don't need that. Border growth, eh. Four faith from, uh, plus four faith from natural wonders. That could, uh, natural wonders, sorry. Um, for each gold and silver. Plus two science and cities with a city connection, that's not bad. Um, plus one production, just period. That's always good. Um, Tundra. There's nothing that really gives me a significant amount of faith. So. Um, just faster growth rate. 
faster growth rate might be my thing. Do that, or I just increase, get plus one and everything. That's kind of meh. I I do like the plus one production, but it's gonna become less significant later on. Ten percent faster growth rate is gonna be consistently useful. So fertility rights. Okay, we got ourselves our pantheon, which brought our faith back down to zero. We need two hundred faith to get a profit. We're not gonna probably get that anytime soon. Alright, first farm done. Start working on the second farm. Alright, you made peace with Kabul. Hm, didn't make very much progress. City got destroyed, just got completely razed, so there is that. She didn't even keep it. Which means I can potentially expand here if I want to. Um, probably not going to. I'd rather stay away from Suica as much as possible. So, 13 turns to get Stonehenge. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get it. It's pretty late. I mean, I, I have a better chance going for Oracle, but... Gotta give it a shot. It's five faith if I get it. Alright, Earth Spirits. They have the first religion. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna get it. There's three left. <laughs> and Suica and Mori Morio Shrine are ahead of me. There it is. Yep, Stonehenge just got built. Um, I did get a Composite Bowman though. That's nice. Um, let's get rid of you. We don't need you. us in the positive. Okay, um, Hanging Garden would be good, or Oracle. Hanging Garden would be bigger benefits. Um, I could go for Temple of Artemis. That was something that people wanted. It would also speed up production of things like Sorceress. Um, I'd rather have the Hanging Garden, though. Faster Grove. Because I'm going to need people to, to run those tiles for the um, other junk. Uh, t -t 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 -t. Open Train's fine. You can go there. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get the Gardens either, but we'll see. When's, when was Gardens? Mathematics? Yeah. There's probably people already going for it. But that's okay. I'm not gonna worry about it either way. So we could... That is tempting, but I, I really don't want to take part in this. <laughs> the piest. That's really something I would not describe Atsuo as. She doesn't worship God, she eats them. Alright. We finished that, that's good. How are we looking here? Yeah, we have we have plenty of spare civil um civvies to uh, take advantage of what we got. Um Speed up our growth further. We'll go here, finish that up, and then we will be on our way. All right, looks like another religion's been founded. Only two more can be found, uh, founded, and it's definitely not going to be by me. Should finish in a turn. <laughs> There you go. So, Terracotta army has been built. Thankfully not by Suika. <laughs> you know, I don't know why your warrior's out here when you're still at war. Um so let's uh let's get started. We're gonna do uh crypts. 
start spamming crypts. About to get a workshop. Oh. Medieval era. Okay. Good stuff. Um, I can't afford anything right now. I'll be so happy if I get the gardens. That would just really make my... Because uh, I'm probably going to only have two cities. Unless I go crazy war. Which I probably will. It's going to take me a bit to get like built up. At least with these tile improvements, I'll be making gold and faith. And I don't have to worry about just building a bunch of freaking faith buildings that only give like one or two faith. I mean, really, I guess the only way you can get faith really quickly is if you make friends with um, religious city-states. Golden Age. Perfect. Come on, six turns. Can you get me the, go the gardens in six turns? All right, Moria Shrine got um, another religion. So there's two uh, religions active on this section of the continent, or this section of the world, rather. What are you doing? Don't you have like a war to do? Okay. Hey, that gave us two gold instead of just one. Fine by me. I ain't gonna complain. So yeah, I can't put them adjacent to each other. So what I'll just do is I'll move this way. I'm gonna... Someone's gonna steal this from me. I can feel it. I just can feel it. Crapping. Get another crypt up and running. Oh, that's right, because we hit a... Because we got, uh, I don't know. Wait, doesn't theology? One second, I have to look it up. Evil spirits, uh, crypts. Theology would increase it to two faith and two. Oh, I see. I know why that's making additional gold. It's because of the golden age. Um. Yeah, theology would actually get us additional faith. So let's actually switch gears real quick. We're going to snatch theology right now and then go straight for civil service. Because that will give me a significant faith boost. It'll practically double it. Temple of Artemis. Glad I didn't go for that. Actually, I would have gotten it in time um, if I had. Fifteen food. That's pretty impressive. This is tense. This is so freaking tense. Alright, one more turn. Please, please give it to me. I need this. Come on. Got it. Perfect. Okay, so production. Oracle would be nice. Workshop would be fantastic as well. Kind of need to get that up and running. Like, yesterday. Alright. It'll take... Let's get... Oracle up and running. It's either that or I go straight for the Great Prophet from Hagia Sophia. Yeah. If I'm going to have any chance of getting a religion, which is pretty slim, I would have to go for Hagia Sophia. Alright, let's go.
I don't really care about spreading religion, I just kind of want my own. And then I can just spread it around here and just mind my own business. Done. All right, we got ourselves another pikeman. Uh, we're not going to get iron anytime soon, so let's go ahead and drop you. Cause you're not going to be able to get upgraded anyway. And we'll give you open field advantage. Go there. Probably should have moved there, then there, but whatever. Okay, Atsu it was working on the Petra. Okay. Three things unnecessary. Making five faith per turn now. Let's get Crypt going. Golden Age is over. Great Wall's been built. Still top in tech. I'm second in population. Take 14 turns to do the Oracle, or I can go for Hagia Sophia. I mean, getting, let's see, what would... What would I get, what, do I, what would I spend that free policy on? I don't really need it for piety. Yeah, I think I'll go straight for uh Hagia Sophia. Yeah, that's pretty much all I can work on. Uh getting an aqueduct would actually be good. But I actually wait, I'll get a free aqueduct anyway, so it doesn't matter. We'll try to get this and if it doesn't work out, it I can I can use it as a tile improvement if I can't get the religion. Your third city. All right, Parthenon's been built. Atsuo has declared war on Suika. This will be pretty interesting. Okay, that's been built. Let's get ourselves another one of these up and running. This is actually pretty significant, being able to build these little crypts that give faith. Uh, I believe originally they used to produce like units, but that was ridiculously overpowered, so they took that away. Zero ID. Okay, get this up and running. My happiness is not 
great mausoleum, okay. Policy. Now I get more money and happiness, and now I have free aqueducts and additional growth. Because, you know, I'm not growing fast enough already. Um, I can get this cotton, but I can't work it. But I can trade it, which would be kind of nice. But I honestly don't really need it, so I guess I won't worry about it. We're also about to get additional food from river tiles, so we'll get additional three food. Wow, that was a very brief war. Maybe they made a deal. Alright, civil service is done. Um, Notre Dame will get me more faith. Education. Get me more tiles, which I don't really need. Macho Pichu, we don't really need. I think going for Notre Dame. Could possibly work. Or I can go straight for machinery and get ironworks. Sure, we'll do that first. Why hasn't the Oracle been built yet? Okay, crypt done. Crypt here. One, two, three. Okay, so I can get a crypt there. Unfortunately, they have to be all spread out now. You can't put them adjacent to each other. Which actually kind of greatly limits how many you can put around. But it's definitely helping. I'm making 9 faith a turn now. Which is nice, I guess. <laughs> Our spirits have just boosted their um, religion. It's quite possible there will be th well, there will be three religions here. I produced the most hammers with just my one city. That's actually pretty impressive. All right. Great profits. Let's get a religion. Yoink. <laughs> All right. I don't even know what to call this religion. Uh, I'll grab that. Guess I'll just go Taoism. Founder of belief. Um, there's not very many options here. Uh, plus one global happiness for every two cities following this religion. Eh. Plus one gold for every four followers following this religion. And other civilizations. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I can just get money. Tithe would probably be best for me. Um, follower belief. Uh, plus two production if you have a specialist. Um, faster growth if you're not at war. Provides two culture and cities. Blah 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 blah. Shrines and temples will give you food. Each world wonder provides two faith in a in city. 
find inspiration. Unfortunately, I don't know any sort of... I mean, the only religions I know of are Moria and the Hakare. So, and I'm pretty sure Miwa doesn't follow either. So, we will go with Taoism, I guess. Kind of lame, but whatever. There we go. We're now producing 20 faith per turn. And we can enhance it soon. Uh, all right. Must have a temple in all cities. Goes up. I have a temple? Oh, I did. I get a free temple. Neat. Which is funny, because I don't even have a shrine yet. Um... That's three free missionaries over here. Maybe I should go for this uh, religion stuff. At least I'll keep it from them spreading it. I'm just gonna. Get, I'm not gonna worry about the oracle. The length of golden age is increased. I wouldn't mind getting the increased golden age. This would at least give me a lot of religion to spread it around. Though there's not really any benefit for me spreading religion, besides getting a little bit of money. So, yeah, we'll go with this. Go from there. Uh, we have 11 followers, so that gave us, like, what, 2 gold? Main thing is the is the wonders giving me faith. All right, so that's taken care of. I am using a workshop. That's good. I'm also about to get a great scientist. So yeah, that's happening. Alright, keep going. Colossus has been built, not a big deal. The merchants I can purchase stuff with faith. It's probably just missionaries. Yeah, I don't care. I wouldn't mind getting a sorceress though. Um as for purchasing buildings, there's not really anything I need to purchase. I mean, the, the most important thing would be the market. Because that'll eventually pay for itself. We also need, like, caravans. We haven't done any caravans yet. So, yeah, that's a thing we should probably do. Let's get caravans up and running. I'm not sure why it's not giving pressure to the other ones. Whatever, we'll go to Florence first then. That's fine. Actually, no, we'll go uh, Sydney first. As much as I would love to spread religion, I, I know this route is safe. Oh, I didn't. Someone beat me to it. Alright, got some money out of it. That's fine. Uh, there's more cotton here. How are we on? Uh... We have room for one more. One more of these uh, crypts at the moment. The rest of them are uh, adjacent, unfortunately. Deal with that. Production. Okay, so no to that. They kind of rushed for it. That's fine. Um, 
get additional faith. I'm tempted to just go for the Oracle if no one's gonna grab it. Nah, we'll go uh, Borbiter and we'll go ahead and spread our religion a bit. At least make sure it gets solid. Actually, um, let's get Grand Temple up. And then after that, we'll be close to getting the Ironworks so we can get that going. But I am out of time, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, make a save here and call it a video. I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this was Civilization V. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time.